Well, a second Democrat has joined the race for attorney general. That's right. Beth White says she's going to seek her party's nomination for that race. She talked to News 8's government reporter Garrick Berquist for this Sunday's episode of All Indiana Politics. Beth White's resume includes two terms as Marion County clerk and a stint as a deputy prosecutor. She most recently led the Indiana Coalition to end sexual assault and human trafficking. She says she would prioritize prosecuting sex traffickers and child predators if elected. I fear that currently our attorney general is not as collaborative as he needs to be in order to serve the people of Indiana. So collaboration with other organizations at every level of government, making sure that people are educated. Parents are the first line of defense to protect our children. I am a parent and I know so many people whose children um, could be vulnerable. And they're vulnerable because their, par their parents really don't know and understand how social media is working. What are the ways in which we can protect our children? And I believe that the Attorney General needs to take a leadership role. I believe the Attorney General needs to be the voice in the state of Indiana for protecting our children, equipping parents, equipping educators, coaches, pastors, band directors, everyone who interacts with children needs to be equipped to understand what's at risk and how to help children. You've criticized Indiana's abortion ban, which is facing several lawsuits. The attorney general's duties include representing the state in legal cases where the state is a party. Would you defend the state's abortion laws in court, absent any changes from state lawmakers? I believe that women and their health care providers ought to make decisions about their reproductive rights. I was very active in my current role on behalf of the Indiana Coalition to End Sexual Assault and Human Trafficking in the abortion debate. We fought hard to make sure that there were exceptions for rape and incest. We do have those exceptions that are, in my opinion, not long enough and not a meaningful remedy. But Oh, oh, I don't need the attorney general at my kitchen table making decisions for my family and for me. I, as a woman, can make my own health care decisions, and I believe strongly in that. But I also understand that the attorney general has a role to play in defending uh, laws that are passed by the legislature. But I would not go after doctors who are performing procedures that are perfectly legal and helping, parent, helping patients um, access health care that they need. That is overreach and it has to stop. There's no primary for attorney general. The parties will choose their nominees at the state party conventions this summer. You can see more of my interview with Beth White, including whether she would sue social media companies this Sunday on All Indiana Politics. It airs at 930 in the morning right here on Wish TV. I'm Garrett Bergquist for Wish TV, wishtv.com or follow us on Facebook for more updates.